Hello and welcome to another Brett Plays video. This one's going to be something different. So I am testing the uh, F4 Phantom 2 on the aircraft carrier MSFS1, which was a free download. Um, I have done a video on this before with the S3 taking off and landing. But I'm going to be using the catapult and arrestor hook. So let's get this thing started up. So I have downloaded and installed the Cloud Assist. Here we go. So the legacy importer uh, creator, Alex, uh, has created a free download for Arrestor Hook and Catapult. So I'm going to take the Catapult and what we might do is we might actually park ourselves over on this uh, launch. We can do it from well, we can do it from anywhere. But we'll park ourselves over here once we get our engine started and we'll get this awesome model uh, taking off and landing. So this is the uh, McDonnell Douglas F4 Phantom. It is an FSX uh, import. It does come over very well. I have noticed though, no pilots. Uh, the lighting system, when it lights up, I do notice that the afterburners or the flame is lit up with just lights instead of the normal flame. So that actually has not come over. And there are no pilots, as you can see. So inside, haven't got all the uh, gauges that have come over. So they must have been uh, either dependent. No, they wouldn't be dependents, otherwise would have them. So there must be customs that didn't like coming over, which is a bit of a shame. But we may be able to work that out later, what is the deal. So let's just taxi forward here. So this aircraft carrier is a free download as well. Uh, there's another one just over there, which I think is the Russian. So this is parked off the UK, uh, down the south. I will put a link in the description for this um, aircraft carrier download pack as well. I think it comes from flightsim.to is where I got it from. So what we do is we'll just park ourselves. We can go a little further. Wouldn't actually take off here. Would knock the uh, E2 off the uh, um, flight deck if that were the case. Okay, so I have flaps down uh, one notch. Uh, I've got my park brake on. So what we do is we go ready to launch. It pops up the tip, uh, disengage park brake to launch, but I don't want to do that without throttle, so I will throttle up. Oh, hang on. Talk to me, thank you. And then we release the park brake. And cue our music. <laughs> not clear to take off. I was not asking for permission. Alright. Do need to turn that ATC off. I don't really want to be able to have to hear them. Alright. Bit of appropriate music for... Uh, Flying, why not? Now I'm going to leave my gear down because what I want to show you. Let's, whoop, let's turn that, here we go. Arrest the hook, extract. Down it comes, thank you, nice and quick. Now I've got to turn that ATC people off automatic, but I've uh, left that on. Now, Try and actually get this to land, and I'm going to use another level of flaps. I notice it ha doesn't actually uh, tell me what level that is at. It would be nice to uh, probably set up that uh, cloud assist with some automatic buttons on the keyboard too, but then it would have to be implemented into off flight sim. So I've got Chunk on the runway here. He's obviously found me online. So Chunk, you're going to be in my video. But I'm going to come in with the uh, arrest hook. Try and do my best. I think 80 something meters is my best so far. 
might actually be able to line this one up too. Oh, it bounces, and it bounces a lot, I notice in this aircraft. So, depending on uh, what aircraft you come in, no, arrestor hook failure. The fact that I actually landed is quite amazing. But that's what I want to show you with the F4 Phantom. We will have some more videos on these, so a little bit of uh, joy of flights and fun on these as well. So the link will be in the description for this aircraft. Uh, like, comment and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll have all the links for the rest of the um, products, including the Cloud Assist launch, in the description. Have a great day. Cheers.